Cleaning glassware has a few steps. The first one is the scrubbing step, where you add water and a glassware detergent, and you use a scrub brush to get rid of any solid that's stuck to the sides or bottom of the glassware. When you're done scrubbing, you should dump out the soapy water. You'll be left with some soap residue in the glassware. You need to rinse that soap out before you can move on to the next step. Once you've removed the soap residue, you can start the rinsing steps. And the first rinsing step is to rinse with several large portions of tap water. And this should remove most of the residue of the soap and any remaining particulate. Once you've done your tap water rinses, you can move on to rinsing with distilled water. The distilled water rinsing step should involve three rinses with small portions of distilled water, no more than 10% of the total volume of the container. So if your container is 100 milliliters, you shouldn't use more than 10 milliliters of distilled water at a time. The distilled water rinsing step really isn't for cleaning, it's more for removing any traces of tap water. And the reason you need to remove the tap water is because tap water often contains dissolved impurities. And when it dries, those impurities will be left in the glassware. The distilled water, because it's had all of its impurities removed, can be used to get rid of the tap water. 